to all my subscribers, I apologize. I've been doing it wrong this whole time. I could be rich and wealthy like all these other black financial channels. All I had to do was listen to them, but I didn't. I didn't know. They popped up in 2020. I had no clue who they were. I didn't know that some of them were mag uh, the, the magicians. I didn't know that some of them were musicians. I didn't know some of them were teachers and some were even in jail by their own words. Some of them were in jail and they learned about the stock market from white people that they were sharing a cell with. I didn't know how, you know, that I could build a dividend portfolio uh, without having a career. I didn't know that I could be rich and wealthy like them and their subscribers. I was preaching do it the hard way. Get a great career. Get a career with a 401k, a pension. Go join the military. Be a policeman. Be a fireman. Start your own business, your legitimate business where you can hire other people. Uh, go into IT. Uh, I was preaching all of that. I'm sorry. I should have just been doing the day-to-day -day plays, buying stocks when they go up. Uh, excuse me. Buying stocks when they go down and selling them when they go up. I could have been buying dog with hat, bulk coin, Shiba Inu, Dogecoin. I could be rich and wealthy just like them. But instead, I read books. I'm sorry. I listen to audio books. I put my money in index funds. I could be so rich and so wealthy like all of them, but I'm not. I'm not. Well, I'm not as rich as them. I mean, I got a little bit of money. I'm comfortable. You know, I own, I, you know, I own some real estate. But if I would have listened to them where they said, don't go to work pretty much. You got to read between the lines. Don't go to work for the white man. All I had to do was participate in the white man stock market. And that would have been an easier way. There was an easier way. Don't participate in going to work for the white man and corporate world. All you got to do is purchase the white man's cryptos. That's all you got to do. Don't go to work for yourself, for the white man and parlay that into other businesses and into your dreams. You know, use the white man's money to build your own businesses and build real estate. No, you can literally buy what the white man sells, the Mercedes and the Gucci and the Teslas and the Louis, and you could participate in helping the white man get even more wealthier. But at the same time, we don't like that white man. I didn't know. I didn't know there was an easier way. I'm sorry I didn't tell you. I'm sorry I listened to Warren Buffett's and, you know, the Burton McKeels and the Peter Lynch's and God rest his soul, Charlie Munger. I'm sorry I listened to, you know, Benjamin Graham where they said, just live life, enjoy life. Life is short. Put your money in index funds and, you know, your, um, your, uh, you know, put your money and just let it do what it's going to do. That I didn't have a financial background. I'm a high school dropout. I don't have time to be looking at finance reports and the day to day and watching other white people on the news tell me where to put my money. All I can do is all I did was go to work and all I did was leave. All I did was live a peaceful life. You know, I built a wonderful real estate portfolio. I have a nice chunky index funds. But who would have thought I could be retired like them or all their subscribers? All their subscribers are rich and wealthy. They don't work. They don't go to work anymore. They're all on the beach with their feet up with the day to day plays. You know, one day it's Apple. One day it's Tesla. Then it's Nvidia. Then it's Bunk. Then it's, you know, uh, Shiba Inu, Dogecoin, Bitcoin. Uh, pallets here. They got the plays. I didn't participate in the plays. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't know who they were. You know, that they didn't, the, the, I didn't know who they were. I didn't know that they had jobs that didn't have any importance and they got laid off during the pandemic. I didn't know that they were not essential. I didn't know their jobs were expendable. I did not know. I had no clue that they were nobodies before 2020. I didn't follow them. I didn't know. I didn't, I didn't do, I'm sorry, I did a background check on them. I did a background check and some of them were, were uh, some of them were musicians, some of them were actually in, in jail, some of them were, were unemployed and then they started dividend portfolios, some of them said they were engineering teachers, some of them were motivational speakers and I didn't know, I'm sorry I didn't trust them when they came on and they said, wake up YouTube, I'm sorry, I'm sorry I led you down the wrong path. 
And just like their subscribers portfolios and just like their subscribers lives. It's a joke, April Fools. Ah, uh, yeah, you're subs uh, all their subscribers. Your portfolio was what this video was. A joke. You ain't got no money. You don't own nothing. Uh, you don't work a job of value. You probably don't even have a 401k. And you will never retire because you're following people who retired off of you. You ever notice? That their lives got better off of you. You're still going to work selling Lucy's and they're retired with some of the nicest cars, nicest jewelry and nicest houses. The joke was on you. Me and my subscribers are smart. We'll build, we, we are building our futures because we did background checks on these people. We don't just follow people who popped up, but you do. And this is why all your stimmy stimmy money is gone. All your money flowed back to the top to the white man that you refused to work for. Guess what? We're on track and you're not. Your money's gone. So keep paying their taxes at the end of the year when they do fundraisers. Keep uh, keep paying for the meet and greets for them to be nice to you. Uh, the same way you pay for them to be nice to you and shake your hand and call you family you're probably the same person that pays for only fans or thinks the stripper loves you after you've been tipping her your little 200 dollars a week paycheck all night april fools your life is a joke straighten up and fly right no regrets get it